Hello everybody, my name is Joy and welcome to Lee Eat, the Lie-Eating Dragon and the Vermilion Vampire. Now I don't know anything about this game whatsoever, so let's jump right into it. Long ago in a small town there lived a family of vampires. They were very kind souls and got along well with the humans there. But one dark night, one of these kind vampires attacked a human in town. Before anyone knew it, they had already sucked out all of the human's blood. The news that they had attacked a human was soon revealed to the others. The vampire was executed and the townspeople lived happily ever after. Or did they? Are vampires real? Are they bad guys? Vampires did exist, but not anymore. And if they were bad, I wouldn't know. In fact, I even doubt this vampire attacked the victim willingly. It's getting late. You should get to bed. Why can't we all sleep together? If you do so, the wolf will come, so lock the door and fall asleep quickly. Fear is the best tool in parenthood. Absolutely. If you stay up too late, you won't be able to get to sleep at all. Okay. Good night, father. So, how much more do we have to walk? Da -da -da. Hey, Papa. Are you listening? You are, right? Shut up, Runt. We're almost there. Just be quiet and walk. I'm not Runt. I'm Afy. And stop calling me that. It's getting on my nerves. Oh, you're mean, Papa. Come on. You're always calling yourself different names. Hey, give me a piggyback ride. Sure, a piggyback ride. There'll be a thousand G. A hundred thousand G. Big dummy. Okay, I'm not entirely understanding the relationship between these two. I mean, I don't want you to call me daddy is a rather harsh thing to say to a child. See, we're here. And remember, call me Leo here. I do not want you to call me dirty. Uh, got it? Yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm playing. Let's see, can I go back? I'm not gonna do that. Can I talk to you? Nope. Okay. Just wanna make sure I explore pro properly. V... Vermilion. It says Vermilion Town. Oh, I'm getting cleverer by the day. As long as you don't forget it right away. Okay. I'm missing the music here. Ah, there we go. Right on cue. So, what are we doing now? There's an informant here, so we gotta sell the info we got at... What? Oh, there's an informant here, so we're gonna sell the info we got at the last town. And this town seems to have quite a bit to gleam itself, so we'll look into that. And then go sell the info? Yes, also shut your trap. But... Okay! Right, first, a place to stay, let's try and find some people. Okay, it's rather dead here. And the vermilion town sounds rather foreboding. Hello there, don't mind me barging into your house, this is an RPG, so it's okay. Huh? Why are you here? What's the matter to you? Why are you here? Just resting my feathers. I'm tired. I'll be fishing for info later. All oh, right. if you find anything out about the town's legend, tell me about it, please. You better pay for it. What do you take me for? <laughs> These are people we know, I assume, otherwise it would be rather weird to ask someone what they're doing in their own house. But that's okay. Okay, I cannot find- I cannot run, apparently. Not yet, at least. Okay, this is empty. I don't suppose we can just go ahead and rummage- What? Nothing's inside. Okay, then. Very well. Very well. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention, this game was, uh, again, a gift from a very dear friend of mine. So, that's really appreciated. Thank you very much. Again, you know who you are. I still don't know whether or not you like to be mentioned, so I'm just gonna do- Not do it? Not this time. Okay, 
So, am I looking for an inn or something? There's only one other person that I've seen so far. Is everyone congregating? Oh, hello there. What are you? Huh? Harry wore a green jacket before. Had black hair. What? Ah, it took me a bit to realize. Oh, he's introducing himself. Never mind. It took me a bit to realize. Changed your whole appearance again, huh? But that scar in your cheek never changes, does it? Hmm? Who's the kid? I'll tell you later. You know where the residents of this place are? Oh, you need a place to stay? Talk to the guy at the lodge's house in the northeast. Think the people here are the only real residents should lend you a place easy. I see, thanks, I'll be back later. Bye now, you too, kid. Let's go before she makes us any more of a bother. What do you got on the table there? What do you got over there? Can I rummage? What? Pants on fire. Nothing's inside. I don't even know what I just did. The... Okay. Pants on fire. Something happened making me a liar, apparently. Oh, there's somebody over there now. Hello there. Oh? Hello. The name's Leo. I'd like to ask you something. Oh, yes. That's perfectly fine. Is there anywhere in town we could stay? We've got food for us, so a place is all I need. You're travelers? Well, there is a place, yes. My sister and I are the only current residents of this town, you see. You can stay anywhere, but this house and the library at no cost, no worry. Right, thanks for your help. But a few people are renting out houses, so... Well... I know, the house with the crates outside was just sorted, so it should be usable right away. Just, if you're staying for a few days, don't go out late at night. What do you mean by that? Uh, what I mean is, there's a vicious wolf that goes around at night attacking people. Right, I see. Take care of yourself. Alright, if you need anything, I'll usually be here at home. Oh yes, introductions. I'm Keith. Keith Rickfire. Glad to meet you. Mail of... Uh, you know what, I'm not even gonna delve into that, never mind. Keith, is it? Sorry to bother you, thanks again. Well, I'll be seeing you. A wolf? That's scary. So scary. You're not a traveler, Papa. You're not Leo either, liar. I'm Leo here. Just Leo. Got it, Runt? Yay. D don't yell at me. Okay, okay, I got it, Leo. Good. We got a place to crash, so let's go to the informant. Let's see. I'm not done exploring just let yet, Leo or Harry or whatever you call yourself. That's a cat. That's a cat with a marvelous outfit. I like that. A whole lot of different books. I didn't know what I expected. It's a library after all. Let's see. Any secrets? Any secrets at all? Oh, by the way, this game is um, part of a three-parter. There's Lee Eat 1, 2, and 3. So I think I'm going to play through all of them if I enjoy the game. Okay, we've already been here. So I guess... This is sparkly. Hat. What is... What is that? Shh, shh, not bad. Truth? Lie? Oh, little lie. Uh, what? Am I supposed to identify what are lies and what are truths in this game? Okay. Knife. Skill? Okay, I have no skill. Ifina. Has no skill. The light text. Uh, a stun gun, electrifying attack. Sure, let's try that. I want to see what it does. There we go. Thirty XP, twenty-two gold. Oh, okay. Look at that. The little lie disappeared. Now I forgot whether or not. No, okay. I forgot whether or not I've gone inside of here. But I doubt it. I don't. I think those are just gonna be the same. Oh, no, no, no. Don't leave the area just yet. Not just yet. This is the biggest house. This whole town is red, even at night. I remember my father told me that's where the name come from. He's not with us anymore. Yeah, but that's, you know, was it red before or did they make it red because the name is familiar? And that's always the question. Chicken or the egg? Nothing's inside. These are big houses. What are those? Stuffed rabbits everywhere. 
Oh god, I'm getting flashbacks to, to the moon. Not supposed to talk to people? Okay, then don't, I guess. That's not creepy at all. Okay, let's move on. That's a big knife on the wall. What is it for? Some sort of decoration. That's locked. Seasonings and other things. Okay, well I suppose not something I would need. There's a key behind the fluffy bunny there. A stuff wrap it, I know, but there's a key hanging behind it and I kind of want that. Okay, no, okay then. Let's see, anything we can find here. This is a thick book. Lots of books. Is this like a secret library? Of, a personal library, I mean, it's off kilter. Well, fix it. It annoys me. Okay then, I guess not much to find just yet. I'm not entirely sure what to do right now. Am I supposed to take that path or am I... Am I gonna sleep somewhere? They set the house with a crate, so maybe I can select to sleep there. Maybe I can save. Because I do not yet know what pressing the escape button does, and with some indie games that will lead to frustration. Okay, I can. I can save! Oh, perfect. Okay. All good. All is good. All is well. Okay, then let's move on to the pathway, because I don't suppose there's much more that we can do here. Let's see if we can find any more little lies. Oh, there's a gate here? Oh, never mind then. Never mind. I'll go back. I'll go explore a bit more? Question mark? Oh, look at that. Look at that. I found you. Oh, cow. What's truth? Oh, I can I can choose. Okay. Uh, stun gun. I don't have enough for that. Yay, we got him in one go. Ooh, if he has increased by one max up. Okay. Okay. All good. Am I supposed to find these before I proceed? That would make sense. Let's see. Is there anything else I can talk to you about? Huh? Why are you here? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Well, there's a bag there in the corner. Let me try if I can... Nothing of any real interest. I still don't know why I got that, um... Achievement called Pants on Fire. I, I I don't get it. Let's see, what do we do? My little sister Rachel, she's very shy. She rarely ever talks. She's the quiet type. As her brother, her figure... Her, her future is a little worry, worrying to me. Her figure isn't. I'm very sorry. I thought you were female as well. I should stop assuming stuff. Um, but what do I do? Do I get her to like me? A key. Oh. Pick it up. Maybe? No? Okay. Kitchen. That's very nice and all that, but I need to know where to go. Oh, by the way, uh, due to popular request, my face game is finally back again. I didn't do it before because I did just want to... Um, I wanted to keep the previous series constant. You know, I, I started them without a face game and I didn't suddenly want to... Want to want to wow, can I talk? Suddenly wanted to introduce it for no reason. Um, damn. This town used to be lively with lots of residents. Not so much anymore, as you can plainly see. Some visitors now, at last. A squeaky clean plate. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, but what... Where do I get to do stuff? There's something here. God's rigid knife and a small macaron. Oh, that's great. Messy. Messy, messy, messy. Very well. Okay, well, at least now I got something. Oh, I can sleep? Oh, that's so cute. She sleeps in bed with me. An oil lamp. I'm not sure what degree of weird that would be. Doesn't matter. There's candy here. Stealthily take it. Sure, I'll be taking that. Oh, another achievement. Have you no shame? I most certainly do not. I most certainly don't. Okay. Well, I, I stole some candy now. Got a room? Yeah, now let's get to business. Right, right, I've been looking forward for this. Hmm, so the bluebird really does exist. Yeah, couldn't capture it, but good enough, right? 
And you brought a feather? That and the info is enough for me. Here's your reward. So I heard you came upon a dragon egg. Is it true? Yeah, about that. Her. Huh? Hmm? She hatched from the egg. I still don't get it either. You're serious? Really? For real? Ahem. Eek. Watch it, mister. Gotta be nice to girls, okay? Yes, you a real big girl. Young. Okay. So, what kind of dragon? Did she slap her? <laughs> Did she slap her just now? So, what kind of dra dragon is she? Thunder? Amoeba? She eats lice. It's her diet. And she can breathe fire, kind of. It'd be faster to show you. Hey, Rentling. That's Afy to you. Well, you see, Afy, me and him are brother and sister. No way. Yeah? I lied. Oh. And now what? She gets physical. Ah, okay. Skill. Toss a knife. Just attack her. Okay, there we go. Yay, I got extra life. See, I see. That was faster to show me. Never heard of and definitely never seen a dragon like this before. Ah, huh, really? So, not even you. But that's about it for now. I'm exhausted from walking. Gotcha. If it's okay by you, I'd pay a pretty penny for this kid. The rent is not for sale. I'll sell you info on her. I'll sell you info on her, maybe. Greedy, greedy. Why do you pick this town to do business in any way? It's so inconvenient to reach, and I don't think the value of the info is worth it. Ah, well. If that vampire legend is true, it would be worth my time, yes? Vampires. Don't go chasing fairy tales. You know, stay realistic. Use dragons. I'd sooner consider dragons the fairy tales myself. Exactly my point. I'm told their bloodline ended a long time ago, but I'm sure I'm right. Says who? Says my gut. Well, if anything comes up, I'll help with what I can. At a price, of course. Right. See ya. Okay, so now we got a dragon with a diet of lies. Hmm, very interesting. Okay, so now at least we got a little bit forward. Can you sell dragons? Um, well, they're rare. They got sturdy bodies, so they could fetch you for a good price. Mainly as slaves. Slaves? Anyways, look into it yourself if you want to know. I've got things to do. You can go off and play. Just don't leave the town. Don't go anywhere strange and then here's a snack for later. Okay, hooray! Oh, okay, now I'm playing as her. Let me let me go back inside and ask her. Maybe she's willing to shed some more information? Hmm, lost your energy? I'm hungry. Ah, I see. Okay, I'll give you cookies. Thank you! Alright, but only if you win the game with me. Game? I've got a ball here. You just gotta guess which hand I've got it in. Got it. Here it goes. Ho. Hop, hop. Ha. Which one? I... It's hard to tell, but... Behind. Uh-huh, you got me. You, you're a sneaky lady. But better than the guy you're always with, right? Yeah. Honest, I like that. Here's your prize. Let's play again sometime. Okay. You're about the same age as the girl in the house. Oh, but I guess dragons don't change in appearance much as they age. Uh, if he, she was just born a little while ago. Hmm? Only recently, huh? But you can talk already. I see. What? I'm not getting it. Is she the dragon or not? Afy is the dr uh, Okay, I I'm already thoroughly confused. But let's go back to the house and talk to that little shy girl for a moment. See if she would be able to talk to me. Without the intimidating guy with me. I'm not supposed to talk to people. Okay then. I really like the... Um, oh god, I don't know what it's called. But the little pictures on the side. Those. I really like them. They're very prettily made. Prettily. Prettily, that's a word. It's gotten dark, hasn't it? The day's ending again. Let's see. Just looking for secrets here. Nothing special. Nothing to worry about. Just looking for secrets. Well, huh, 
No secrets, huh? Okay, then. I'll be back later. I'll be scavenging this later. This seems like the type of game with secrets. Uh, let's see. What was the house of the other woman again? This was my house? I believe this was hers. Hi there. Once hairy, greedy before that. Black hair, blonde hair, red. I wonder if his hair hurts. Do you know Papa's real name? Yeah, I do. It's a pretty pathetic one. Well, tell me. Danke. Calls him Papa, or does he make her do it? Uh, do that. Oh, she wants me to pay him money to learn him. Okay, fine. Whatever. Douche. Okay, then I guess I cannot find me Papa just yet. That's fine. I can fetch her my own. After all, I'm a dragon. Oh, let's see if I can wander off into this path now. I don't think I could, but maybe because this fence was blocked off. Even though I'm a dragon, I could fly over it, but that's okay. That's okay. That's no problem. Hmm? All alone now? Afi is alone now. Oh, well, want to talk with me for a bit? Shall I tell the story of the butterfly whose flapping caused a tornado? Or perhaps the story of the dreaming illness? For money, right? Then no thanks. He taught you well. Hmm. Alright, if you're bored, would you call my partner here for me? He should be in the library. His name is Levin, recognizable by being a cat. Okay. Please and thank you. Okay, then. We are going to fetch the cats. Is that what we're doing now? Is that fetch missions? I better get rewarded for this. Oh, who are you? I haven't seen you yet. What? You want to play or something? I do. Yeah, yeah, let's play. All right, then let's play word change. You start. R is for relay. Yama. R is for roulette. Entertainer. R is for... R is for ruler. Register. R I don't know anymore. Then we're done here. See ya. You're no fun. That's true. Oh, God. Okay, he's just, he's just gonna ignore me. Very well, then. Pop. Um, are you Mr. Levin? Yes, and... Oh, well, I... Oh, I don't... I didn't actually know her name, so... The lady with the crazy hair who goes ch a bunch called for you. Ah, you mean Rosalie. I see. Thank you very much. Excuse me. That's settled then, I guess. Favor complete. Okay, what's next? I heard these games were pretty short, so I'm not entirely sure how I'm gonna play this. I'm gonna play the first one... Uh, entirely, I think. Unless it takes longer than an hour, because that makes it, for some reason, harder to edit with my software. I don't know why. I have no idea. No, wait. Down. This was Rosalie's house. There you are. Hmm. So then. Oh, you were talking about stuff I'm not supposed to hear? Okay, then. I'll take my leave. I'll look for other stuff to do. Uh, do you get anything new? Oh, guys, can I see? No, have me. Let me have a little no. E okay. No, never mind. Never mind. Ah, on your own now. The tongue doesn't have much in the way of places to play, so it must be boring for a child. If he's not a child, so I'm not bored. Is that right? Pardon me. Ah. Uh, oh my. Would you like something to eat? I like making sweets, so I could whip something up. Yay, I love sweets. Oh, they won't make me full, though. Are you of a race that only eats something in particular? Yeah. Hey, mister, tell a lie for me. A lie? I was cleaning until just now. After that, I did some reading. And I finished making dinner a little while ago. Take it easy. What are these? Uh, now I punch him. Which one's the lie? Um, which is it? Do you need assistance? No, I got this. Do you? Do you got this? I was cleaning earlier. This is a broom, so that he might have been truthful about cleaning earlier. After that, I did some reading. 
That might be true because you got an entire library here and there's books over there. You just finished making dinner. I don't see dinner. Okay, let's try this. I have no skills yet. Lolia text. Athena text. Will I ever know whether or not this was an actual lie or not? We're just kind of slapping each other here because I have no special attacks or anything. Now, yeah, almost there now. There we go. This should do it. Yay! Did I guess correctly or... Oh. I like the style of this game. So, this is what you call eating a lie. Yeah, right. Mm, I never knew of such a race. Our race has a special diet too, but lies? This is surprising. Does your family ever leave the town, mister? Uh, no. There are many roads impassable by vehicles, so it's inconvenient even getting here. Inconveni? Yes, you're tired from your trip too, I suppose. Yeah. And the town's being emptied is very and the town being emptied is very worrying as well. I'm rather frail and my sister is a younger and frailer girl still. Ah, uh, I feel bad for you guys. Bad? Well, there's all these lands and towns all over the world. You haven't seen it all, but it's all different and all great. The world's really huge. If you say so. But I'm satisfied with the small world with my dear sister. Still, I thank you kindly for the conversation. Hehe. -he. Uh, anything else? Our race has a special diet as well, it would seem, but that trait has greatly weakened over the ages. Oh, are you a vampire? Is that what you are? Huh? I'm onto you. Don't think I don't know. I just want someone to talk to for a little bit. Okay. Um, Rachel, right? Yeah, Rachel. I'm Athena. Call me Effie. If he is that red man who what I, I can tell who's talking is that red man who was with you your brother nah Leo's my papa your father I don't have a father anymore just my brother um really yeah when we were little he just collapsed one day and the next day he was gone are you lonely without your dad it's fine my brother's here he's really nice Oh, but... But? One time, he did strangle me. He looked really sad. Uh, yeah. Leo, uh, yells at me, sure, but he's never strangled me. Uh, I see. Maybe we're different then. We're a different race from the townspeople. That's why everyone went away. Ah. Uh, I don't get it, but if... But if you don't like something, you should just say no. Or else nobody will know. No. 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 Once more. No! You got it. <laughs> Thanks, it was fun talking with you. Yeah, you talked a bunch, Rachel. But you should play outside sometimes too, let's play again later. No! Yeah, I lied. Yeah, let's play. Oh, she lied? Oh god, it's time to eat. I hope my health is still okay. No, no! I wonder if I should eat this. Yeah, why not? Eat it. Don't worry about your hips, girl. Uh oh. Oh no. Okay. Okay, I'm good. No worries. I'm just gonna save real quick, because I forgot to do that. I haven't done that in a while. Just do that a couple of hundred times. Okay. Okay. Then we're not gonna play outside, I suppose. But I'm pretty con pretty convinced that these are the vampires. The moon looks red, doesn't it? I don't know why, but it's long looked that way here. But you know, I hate that red moon. I hate the color red. I hope someday I can see a white moon. Why that? I mean, I can understand that if everything in your town is red, you would get pretty sick of it, but... Has... No... Did this... Just change color. 
Is that what happened? I don't know. Maybe that's just... I, I don't know. I don't know. Did the, did, did the town change color? I became an informant to stave of boredom. It's quite a fun line of work. And whatever happens, Levin is here to protect me. I'm sure he is. My eyes are a bit worn out. I would not say reading is one of my strong suits. Okay then. Well, that might be because you're a cat, but I don't mean to judge. So, where haven't we been yet? Let's see, let's talk to you again. Once Harry, greet before that, black hair, blonde hair, oh, never mind. Yeah, 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 you just wanna get money from me. An impossible amount of money for a kid. If you actually wanna extort a kid, you could do it easily, but you choose not to. You choose to be a dick about it. Um, maybe he went to our house. Maybe that's why the colors are different. If they are different. There he is, hi there, papa. Had fun? Yeah. Alright, now give me the usual. Tell me everything that happened and what you heard from people. Okay. That's it. Yep, that's all for now. I see. That leads credence to the theory of them being descendants of vampires. Vam. A race that thrives on people's blood. They eat blood? Or drink it? Suck. They attack people and suck out every last drop. They die. Yes, yes they do. These days vampire bloodlines have weakened such that they don't drink blood anymore. But it's also possibly possible their nature is just lying dormant. In any case, the info's too shaky to say anything yet. Yawn. Sleepy. I'm going to bed. You should too. Don't go do anything weird. Hey, Leo. Don't grab my sleeves just because they're long. Why do you think I eat lies anyway? If I knew that, you'd have a mountain of sweets in front of you by now. Really? Well, why am I the only one who can eat lies? You and other people can't. Sleepy. Yeah, well, I'm not sure, but it's a fantastic power like nobody else's. See, Effie, even if you mean to tell lies, they end up haunting you. And lies that come out of guilt and regret and all, they get bigger. Then it gets too much to handle and lies completely overtake you and then just total darkness. But if you eat people's lies before that happens, you can keep, that, keep them from their fate. So I think it's a wonderful power. I see. So I'm pretty amazing. Oh yes, so very amazing. But when you lie, Leo, monsters don't appear, like with other people. Listen, Ify, everything I say is 100% truth. Even if I were lying, if a lie's never found out, it's not really a lie. Okay, I'm off to bed. Oh, but the night's only just started. Go to bed, now. Okay. But I'm not even sleepy. Let's go have fun. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Why do you make me select stuff? No, right. Okay, I just took a rest and apparently it had no effect. Can I... Can I... Can I bother you? He's asleep. Fuck. You flicked his forehead. No reaction? Okay, what, what if I try it again? No? Okay, then. Very well. I suppose I'll stop being a douche. Um, let's head here first. Let's just be systematic about this. And try and do it one by one. Hello there. Vampires, huh? I wonder if vampires can soar in the sky. If they have the bat ability. Okay. How would you know about vampires, by the way? Did you eavesdrop? See, what do you have to say? Hmm? Hey, Effie, where's the white-haired guy? Asleep. Oh, that's early. Hey, Effie, do you still remember when you were born? Yeah, um, I thought things were bright and then I saw Leo. And his eyes got all white. And then I got a bath towel. I see. I see. Well, do you know why you eat lies? Um, that I don't know. That's quite... That's nice, very interesting. He's quite the liar, so you're never short of food, are you? Um, when someone lies, I can smell it out. But I can't eat it until I know for sure it's a lie. If I eat the truth, it tastes gross. But Leo doesn't smell of lies, and I can't tell what's a truth or a lie. It sucks. And he even keeps his truth to a minimum. 
Hmm, a real enigma he is. So he can't eat clever lies. And if someone knows it's a lie, or if they lie themselves, yeah, I'm a real mystery. I'm real mysterious too. Hey, about those heart fruits? What are those? Oh, you mean these love berries? The yellow ones are sweet, but the red ones are a little sour. Also, they're pretty soft, so if they go splat if you throw them at people, get some all sticky. Myself, I've thrown them into the eyes of my foes to daze them. Aren't they food? Uh, so many mysteries I've been developing. A real interest in you, Afi. Easy, I won't do anything. Oh, right. There's still a little something I need to check. And look at the time. You should get back to... Didn't that guy tell you not to go out at night? What, the wolf thing? Can't be that scary. I've beat up bears before. Bears? But you're just a weak little girl, Ify. Go back to... Go back and get some rest. I'm strong too, rawr. Yawn. <laughs> See? Good night. Head straight home now here. See you tomorrow. Okay, bye-bye. Yeah, that was not an awkward laugh at all. I am so good at voice acting. It's got dark, huh? I should go straight back. Man, I got a bad feeling. What about the Wolfie? I wonder if I should just go to bed. No. No. No, you shouldn't. Wait. Okay, now, now, now you're good to go. Now, now you're good to go to do whatever you... Go. At, get out. Okay, thank you. Get back. Get back. Library. Nobody there. That's not what I meant. I wanted to go visit the little girl. Hello? Anybody in here? This is locked. And the music's gotten eerier. Why is that? I'm just knocking on your door in the middle of the night? Rachel. Um, what about here? Keith. Get, get in there. There you go. Hello, Keith. Hello, mister. Asleep. Okay, then. Uh... What about the other lady? So can I talk to you even more? Sweet dreams. Good night. Okay, what about you? Oh, you're asleep too, both of you. I appreciate how you give your kitten their own bed. No? Okay. Okay, then. Ooh, maybe the gates have now opened. Or perhaps there's something interesting to find in these empty houses, because there really hasn't been any sig anything significant in them. Okay, let me try the path one more time. I want to... Oh. Somebody's there. You're... The... Bad end. You have chosen poorly. I got an achievement again. I've chosen poorly. Okay, bed and I suppose the wolf destroyed me. So I'm just gonna go to bed. I think that's what I'm gonna do. And not murder myself. That would be great. That would be good. Okay. Go nap. Yes, you should just go to sleep. Everything will be just fine if you go to sleep. Hey, that scream just now. Let's check it out. Stay right behind me and don't wander off. Okay. Any indication of where they came from? Oh, what are those? She left her little heart candies. Love berries. Excuse me, love berries. Okay, that was nothing. Hi, did you hear anything? Jeez, that woke me up. Gosh, I'm sleepy. Going to see what happened? I'm sure you would be fine, but take care out there. I heard a loud sound. Will you be alright going out there? Yeah, we'll be fine, I guess. Um, let's see. Library? No. No, didn't expect it to be in the library. That's different. Something on the table is different. What happened? 
No? Okay. Then what? Oh no, am I supposed to go into the foresty area? Hold on, let me save then quick. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Gotta remember myself, gotta remind myself to do that. What was that? That didn't look good. Is she impaled into the fence? Dead. No good. She's gone. Really? Really. Hey, she's wounded on the neck. Yeah, you're right. Uh, it looks like bite marks. Well, what to do here? Off to tell the winged informant, I suppose. What we're gonna do? We'll give them a call. Much as I hate to see them. It's their job to deal with all this kind of thing, after all. Dead. Oh god, that's pretty gruesome, I guess. So, she was killed by a vampire and not a wolf? And how exactly would I call? Could I call from the library? Vampire. Vampire. Mm, was there somewhere a phone? And was this locked, by the way? I, It is. Oh, it's locked. That's suspicious. Very suspicious. Something happened? Someone died. Probably murder. Huh? It was the informant in the hat. Let me your phone so I can call you know who. I'll make the call. They will be here tomorrow morning. At the earliest. Go to your place, lock the door, or stay inside. Glad you understand. Won't be asking for any money later, right? You're so rude. I just don't want to lend you anything important to my work. I wouldn't stand for it if you sneakily made off with the personal info on this phone. You trust me that little. What are we gonna do about her? Just gonna have to leave her until they'll ar arrive. Yes, if she was indeed murdered, we wouldn't want to make any missteps on the crime scene. Yeah? You're leaving her like that? Can't do much else, we're no experts. Experts. Still though, it's hard to believe the Hatter was done in... Was done in? Was she rather strong? Oh, was done in, as in, okay. But she could also go down quick if someone got behind her. How would she? Is that what happened when you first met? Still not enough info, we'll gather more tomorrow. Oh, and just at a glance, it looked like there were bite marks on the neck. So you think it's this town's vampire story? Still think it's up in the air as to whether that's true. Hmm, how puzzling. Let's think it over carefully tomorrow. Good idea. Alright, see you. Take care. Right then, that's odd. What do you think all about this? So I see another one. So this has happened before, huh? Alright then. Let's go ahead and take a nap. Can you get to sleep? I don't know. If you really can't fall asleep, you can sleep over here. Mm. As if you're actually that dejected. Good night. Good night. Sleep here? Sleep where? Sleep with his, him in the bed? That informant with the hat just stopped moving. And I'd only just been talking with her. Will I even get to sleep tonight? I might not. Ow! Finally, we're leaving. Get ready. I'm sleepy. I forgot more where they came from. I'm up, morning. Good, let's go. Oh, don't, don't just slap me, you bastard. Oh! People. Long time no see. Yeah, to be expected, though. You're always around when these things happen. A child? Hey, let me make this clear, she's not my kid. Captain, I'm all done with... You. You again? I don't suppose you're the culprit in this case. And that child there, isn't she a dragon? 
First fraud, now kidnapping? Where does it end with you? Dragon? She hatched from an egg. The egg just suddenly appeared under my bed. And hey, just try and prove the fraud incident. You're not calling me a crook without evidence, are you? Calm down a bit, Brett. But, as you wish. Hmm, indeed, she does not seem to be a dragon. She does seem to be a dragon. Fellow dragons know each other like that, huh? He's a dragon? Right, forgive me. Hello there, miss. I am Neil Macefield, captain of the police. This is Vice Captain Brett. He and I are both dragons, same as you. I've never met any other dragons before. I'm Athena, call me Effie. We still have to business to attend to, so excuse us for now. We intend to stay until the culprit is caught. Come to us for anything. Captain. Unless I indicate otherwise, it is our duty to protect even these two. Thanks. So long then. So, those guys are dragons too? First time you've met them, huh? Well, I've been avoiding them as much as I can. But when it comes to dragons, they know their stuff. <coughs> I see. Time for me to gather info. You can go play, I guess. Okay. You know the drill, don't wander off too far. I know. Alright. Let's go to see her first. Okay, give me just a second to check up on my recording. Alright, I just realized that I've been recording for over an hour now, so I'm gonna leave it at this for this episode. I think it's gonna be a much longer game than I expected. People, people mentioned that it was a very short game, but I... I think it looks otherwise. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll leave a bunch of links down in the description to this game and to stuff from the developer if I can find it so you can play this game for yourself. So anyway, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!